Alright guys, what is going on and welcome back to the episode of our Pokemon Storm Silver Egg Lock. Hopefully you guys are having yourselves a great day today. If you do want to go and support the episode, make sure you go and drop a like down below. Of course, the support is greatly appreciated. So, last episode we made our way to Mahogany Town and the objective today is to go ahead and uh, head up north to the Lake of Rage. Catch the, or hopefully catch, the shiny red Gyarados and uh, then make our way into the Team Rocket hideout and do some stuff there. So it should be exciting, eventful, uh, eventful jam-packed, trying to think of more words, exciting, thrilling. You get the gist of it. Either way, our squad is looking heat. Still, as usual, we got our boy Shaggy the Down fan. Hopefully, we can get him Earthquake or something sometime soon, because this moveset is honestly pretty underwhelming. Either way, he's got Takedown, Assurance, Ice Shard, and Fissure. Zombie, the Leafy Ant with Psycho Cut, Bite, Risk Leaf, and Aerial Ace. Zelda, the Gardevoir with uh, Psychic, Calm Mind, Shadow Ball, Magical Leap. Or on the Luxray with Night Slash, Ice Fang, Fire Fang, and Spark. Nano, the Typhlosion. Holding the Life Orb now. Uh, with, well, I think he was holding the Life Orb. Anyways, with Quick Attack, Lava. A plume at Thunder Punch and Flamethrower. And last but not least, Kelfier, our starter, still going strong with Brick Break, Shadow Sneak, Will O Wisp, and Fan Attack. Personally, one of my favorite team members. I don't know who it is right now. It's probably Kelfier, um, Zelda, Zombie, Orm, Shaggy, or Nano. I like them all. <laughs> I'm gonna be completely honest. Um, so I know if we go in there, it's a trap. And we don't want to do that. So we'll just get our encounter instead for this route. And of course, um, the encounter for this route. Uh, is separate from the uh, Lake of Rage Gyarados because that encounter is a static encounter, so we can get that no matter what. So that is okay. I just wanna. I feel like I just need to go over that every single time something like this happens, and I want to grab this item down there for some reason. Something is telling me to grab this item, and we can't run away. So I guess we'll never, we'll never get the item. I guess we we, we never really will get a. Okay, I guess that line you just really wanted to battle us. Which is fine by me. Sure. See, leaving Shaggy up front is kind of annoying because we can't really run away. So I'll just do... I'll do Zombie. And we'll be good. I'll just save these guys for later. We don't need to battle them. They're just... They're all free. It's, it really doesn't matter. The Lake of Rage is actually a crater. Yada yada. Yada yada. Oh, I thought he was going to give us the Super Rod. Uh... <laughs> Interesting sprite glitch, I do say so myself. Alright, so the reason why I want to head over here really quickly before we- Oh, we can't even surf. Oh my god, I'm so freaking stupid. I'm so dumb. I- I- It's pretty funny at the same time. I don't- I just keep forgetting we don't have a flying type or a water type, so we can't surf or fly. So we need to go get our homeboy, the god- the godsend himself, Pelipper. We need to go get him right now. I'm trying to think, is there a boss battle in this Team Rocket hideout, or is it just Ariana? And you do a double battle with Ariana, I'm pretty sure. And we also get three static encounters there, being the uh, three electrodes. I just remembered that. Because those are all static uh, static Pokemon, so they're, they're separate encounters. So that's going to be sweet. Oh, you trying to get an aerial ice? I would normally be pretty scared of you, but I have coverage, and you didn't die. Oh. Uh, I don't know why I was scared that that cross poison was going to kill me. If a times four uh, aerial ice didn't kill that thing, I don't know why I was scared. Raticate. See, Raticate are actually pretty scary now, and I don't want to mess around with him. What y'all know about Raticate, though? Raticate in this game are Raticate on crack. They just, they know it's... Exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, here's the thing. I, I know I'm pretty sure Raticate gets pursued. But my defense fell, so what else can I do? <sighs> Thank you. If you were pursue, I would have cried myself to sleep. Die. Jesus Christ. I don't know what they did to eradicate, but I kind of want one now. I don't know what if he buffed, if Diana buffed eradicate, uh, eradicate stats. Um, but I need one in my life now. I, I need eradicate. This has to happen. Because this thing is too powerful. This thing is too powerful. I just cannot wait to get a good ground move on Shaggy. Oh my god. That's gonna be the that's gonna be the beginning of a new era, I swear. 
Alright, Fa why is Falconer calling me? Why? Can someone please tell me? What could Falconer out of all people need from me? I still have a- oh, I was just about to say I still have a super repel up right and it immediately goes away. Perfect timing. There we go, we're finally back. And isn't Lance supposed to be standing right here? Or does he only stand here afterwards? Hold on, I wanna see what this man has to say. Well, I don't know. All right, either way, here is the red Gyarados. I'm pretty excited, actually. Yeah, sure. I've actually been waiting for this for so long. I want I've been wanting to swap it out for a shiny Pokemon. All right, so wild. Ga oh my god, I know it's a static encounter, but every single time I hear that, uh, the little uh, thing, my heart just goes. Oh, it's a shiny. All right. Um. What is the plan here? That is the question. Okay, it is definitely not to die to a red Gyarados. That is not the plan. We're going to switch out. And we're gonna go to Kelf here. Holy crap, bro. Jeez, okay, I guess not. Maybe tomorrow. All right, I need to burn this thing. I do not care. I normally don't want to burn Pokemon like this, obviously, because we want to catch them, but... Shit, I am I am burning you, because that Aqua Tail did so much. And now I'm just going to chuck Dust Balls. That's all I'm going to do. I'm just going to chuck Dust Balls now. Does that burn? We should be able to get it before it before it dies to burn. I really hope so. I'm going to be so depressed if we don't. And I really hope that this, because I really can't afford to, um... All right, I'm gonna throw Ultra Balls. I'm getting really nervous now. I'm gonna be so freaking pissed if we don't get this thing. Please, dude. All right, maybe I, maybe I just don't need to speed up. Maybe I just shouldn't speed up. Maybe I should just let it catch. One, two, three. Yes, let's go. All right, we got Shiny Gyarados. Perfect. The atrocious Pokemon. We got the Red Scale. Noish. All right, so I know, is this the choice specs? Yeah, awesome. Awesome, I knew you got it around here somewhere. I'm pretty sure you get like, no, I was gonna say, I think you get Fire Blast and all those moves here, but no, that's in Diamond and Pearl. When you go to the uh, lakes, that's where you get the elemental moves. All right, so now we can go back to Mahogany. Oh no, we don't go back to Mahogany Town. I'm so stupid. All right, well, I guess now that we're here, we can get an encounter for the Red Gyarados. And then I guess after the episode, we can do, um. Uh, the rest of the encounters. Maybe we'll do this at the beginning of the uh, next episode. Either way, this red Gyarados needs to be swapped out for a Pokemon. And um, also, I should probably switch to this box, right? I'll name it the same thing. Actually, hold on. I have a better idea. I'll give it a hat. There we go. Ready? You're about to see the hat? You see the hat? It's a little cat. It's like what I'm wearing right now. Alright, there we go. Looks so dumb. Okay, so that's four. This is the moment of truth. All right, who's gonna be swapped out in Mage Shiny? Lusamine, holding the Moonstone. Okay, I like I like the name and I like Moonstone. Oh, it's it's oh it's probably a called Fairy. I, I'm gonna bet it's a Clefairy. Cause Lusamine has a Clefairy. Or she has a Clefable. Or it could also be a Wiggly, a uh, Jigglypuff. It's a Cleffa. I'll take it. I'll take it. So we need to make this Cleffa shiny. That's what we need to do. And I'm not going to sleep on um, Cleffa or Clefairy at all. Clefable. Alright, so there's Lusamine. First, let's just make sure this thing's legal. Looks perfectly fine to me. All right, let me make it shiny real quickly. I'm just gonna do it right on camera. Uh, you guys are gonna see me do it. I won't be able to actually see Pokegen because DX Tori, which is my recording software, by the way, uh, for all that uh, you that want to know, will not pick up Pokegen, or it won't switch from Tsume over to Pokegen. So I'm just gonna open the ROM. I'm gonna find Cleffa, view data. Um, let's see, how do I do this? How do I do this? How do I do this? Shiny Leaf? No, it's not that. 
It's, um... Can't check the shiny box. How the hell do I do this? Generate shiny ID. I don't know how to do it. I'm gonna be completely honest, I have no idea how to do this. Um, I just figured it'd be easy. No. Wait, hold on. Shiny, yeah. Search. There. I think I got it. Let's try. Let's see. If I got it. Let's load it up. Import backup memory. Storm Silver. ROM. Come on, please say this worked. That'll just make this so much easier. If not, I'll try one more time. Oops. Damn it! How do I do it? How do I do it? View data. Huh. I don't know why. I generate shiny ID? I don't freaking know. Wow, this makes me look really stupid because I seemed like I seemed like I knew what I was doing. Uh... Come on, man. Show me the shiny. I can't just check the shiny box. I don't know why that's a thing. Well, that's not a thing. Hold on, what if I just go here? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a better idea. I don't know, I can just make the Pokemon from scratch. I'll just do it off screen. I'll figure it out. I'm sorry, I don't know how to do it. Um, if anyone knows, actually, I can just I can just figure it out. So I'll just recreate Lusamine, and I'll make Lusamine shiny off screen. Uh, sorry for wasting your time. I don't freaking know. All right, either way, I'll just do a, a couple episodes, or a little bit longer. Either way, uh, I will set Lusamine to the side really quickly. Well, not really quickly, I just do it. Uh, put it over there. First person in this box. Actually, do I even need to do that? Just pick up you. And actually, no. I want you because I want to just fly back immediately. I'm, I'm, I'm discombobulated. I need food. That's what I really need right now. I haven't ate a lot today. I had lunch and it's seven and I haven't eaten yet. Anyways, I had food. I don't freaking know. Either way, Let's run really quickly. I'm so embarrassed that I couldn't figure out how to do that shit. I really am. I'm so sorry. Uh, I don't know why they did it. just didn't- it won't let me just check shiny. I don't know why I can't just make it shiny. I think it has to do with maybe like the shiny ID or something. And imagine that. You get a fire move and you're able to hit me for super effective damage. Imagine. But yeah, I forgot to talk to Lance. Chancey. This should give a lot of experience. Wait. For a second, okay. I don't know why, but for a second I thought that said something about Wonder Guard, and I was like... Like, uh, you okay there, buddy? You okay there? Just talking about if a fairy can be friends? Well, I just hatched a someone to be shiny Cleffa. So how do you feel about that? How do you feel about that? Yeah, I'll just make one from scratch. I feel like that's probably the easiest way to do this. Man, can I do it while I'm battling this dude? No. Because all I have to do is go like this. Go like this. I just have to go Cleffa, nickname, Lusamine, uh, level one, nature modest. Um, let's see, uh, ability. Well, just check shiny, right? I'll just do this once we go back to the Pokemon Center. So I can check up on everything. I'm not gonna get the IVs right, because it doesn't really matter, I'm gonna be completely honest. But, uh, it's fine. Alright, so we beat Ron, and there we go. Alright, Lance. Yo, Supra, uh, I heard some rumbling, so I came to investigate. I saw you way back earlier, the way you battled, and I can tell that you're uh, a trainer with a skill. 
cool. Alright, so our objective is the, uh... I think it's that one hideout. Oh, this is where Lance uses hyper beam on a dude. It's insane. Alright. There we go, we'll heal up. Let me just triple check everything about Cleffa. Alright, so... Let's see, you're modest, you have... Ability, cute charm. Origin. Soul Silver, don't think it matters. Shiny Leaf, don't know what that means. You are a female. Um, I think that's all there. Met, doesn't matter. Just do as a game. Sure. Sure. Stats. Um, I'll just do randomized IVs. Attacks, you have... Pound. Charm. Wish. Um, let's see. That doesn't matter. OT. Supra. Yeah, I don't really care about the rest of that. And then set. Perfect. And then save Pokemon from tabs. New. Cleffa. There's new Cleffa. Now we just got to open uh, the save file. Boom. And then all we got to do is... Well, I'm going to make a save state real quickly. Boom. Delete the other Lusamine. Add this one. And then load the save file. It's not shiny anymore. The what the hell? Hold on. Oh, it is shiny. It's checked. All right, hold on. Save file as. All right, hold on. Let's try this now. Let me see. Please work. That make this so much easier. The fuck happened here? <laughs> uh, we're kind of we're halfway there. Hold on. Lucamine. File. Save as. Import back a memory. All right, this should be it. Wait, I think this means we have to go talk to Lance again. This is the most discombobulated episode I think I've ever done in my life. Lusamine. Perfect, we did it. We now have our shiny Cleffa. Nice, and so now we have to go talk to freaking the dude again. All right, we did it. Well, guys, I just want to apologize. I'll just make today's episode a little longer. To, uh... Make up for this. So yeah, I'm pretty sure we have to go talk to Lance again, because I... I mean, I made a save state, but... Yeah. It's fine. It's fine. We'll live. We shall live. I'll just try to avoid the trainers. I'll try my best, I should say. Because this one only looks that way, and we ran into her. We ran into... This dude up here, also. So as long as we can get past him, it shouldn't matter. Yes, there we go. What's up, buddy? All right. We're back on track. We're good. We got him. And Lyra's calling us. It's really not the time, homegirl. It's really not the time. We're at 19 minutes and we've actually done nothing. We have done nothing. All right. I was just saving just so, just to make sure. And um, let's get you for you. Oh no, we have to swap you two. That's right. Just in case we catch anything, I want it to go over here. All right, we're off. Dragon, I yeah, th that dude is dead. I do not care. What took you so long, Super? Just as I thought. Uh, strange radio signals coming from here. 
The stairs are right here. Alright. So this place is hella annoying from what I remember. There's just battles on top of battles. I mean, I'm pretty sure they'll all be decently easy, so I'm not too concerned, but... At the same time, it's gonna be kind of annoying, so... You know what? We're in it for a long ride. And we don't have Earthquake or Rock Slide or anything like that. Uh, at least we have uh, the leftovers to help a little bit with the recoil takedown. Or recoil from takedown. Primate. Fire Punch. Actually, if you have Ice Punch, I definitely don't want to be in here right now. No way, Jose. I'll just go to Zelda. Yep. See, there's the Ice Punch. I don't know why. It maybe predicted my switch. Maybe he's a... A mastermind now. And I guess we hit ourselves in confusion. That's, not, that's what we do now. It's so frustrating. I hate that. I hate that that's a thing. Like, I don't get it. Like, when I get confused in school, when I'm taking like a test, and if I get confused, I don't like stab myself in the face with a pencil. I think about it. I don't get it. I don't get why you have to hurt yourself. I, I, it makes sense that you would just not do anything at all. Bat. We're gonna aura him for this thing. Alright, spark. If this is what all these battles are gonna be like, oh my god. I am not excited at all. I am really not. Woke up. Spark. Please kill. Thank you. It's like the only thing we have going for us. Is the fact that that spark killed. Oh yeah, that's another one I forgot. We got it's back to back. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. That thing's trying to eat souls. What is going on? Are you guys ready? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, ready for the tech. I was waiting for that to not kill. Oh my god, that would have been a nightmare. Muck. Um, we'll go to Nano. I know we're trying to train some of our other Pokemon, but... Actually, this thing's the... The special defensive wall, so technically, I mean, what else are we gonna do? It's not like Don Fan is Earthquake. But yeah, we're good. This thing is, there's gonna be a lot of speeding up, so I apologize. Maybe I'll make the background music a little quieter this episode because of that. Alright. Heal you. Oops. Heal you. Alright, there we go. Oh, listen to the- when you walk, it's like you're walking on like steel tiles, it's so weird. <laughs> Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Coughing. Well, hello there, friend. Isn't it like, like the exact same trainers? Or it's not the same trainers, it's like the same Pokemon. Isn't that what it is? I really hope not, oh my god. That would just be so stupid. Yeah, that's what it's looking like, though. Alright, well, maybe Zelda will not hit herself this time. Look at that. Look at that. The clean one hit KO. Golbat now. Um, I'm just gonna stay in. This thing is gonna be fast. Like, okay, that's fine. Yeah, those things are fast. You are gone. And it's one after another, too, which is kind of annoying. I remember how stressful this part of the game used to be um, in, uh, what's it called? Uh, like, Heart Gold, Soul Silver, the normal games. Because they really didn't give you... Um, I don't think Ice Shard will kill, and I'm really scared that it won't. The Pokemon that you were fighting against at this part were, like, Zubats and stuff, and they were giving absolutely no experience at all. So it was so hard for you to stay on par with levels because they, you know, there's a lot of trainers, but they just weren't giving you good Pokemon that give good experience. So you were stuck just, just really under leveled. I mean, granted, the Elite Four in this game is not too high level. Like we would be okay for the Elite Four right now if this was normal Hard Gold Soul Silver. Because I think 42 is around where you kind of want to be. Um, I know you can, at, I know you can do the Elite Four with like 42s at least. That's what I normally would try to do when I played Hard Gold Soul Silver. Um, I mean, if I was doing a Nuzlocke, I would want him a lot higher, but for a casual playthrough, I think it's doable. If you want to spam some potions here and there, but still doable. I remember I used to, like, Choice Scarf my Feraligator, because uh, if your mom will buy you a Choice Scarf if you have her save your money. 
and I would use Ice Fang, and I would just I would just run through Lance's team because I was just faster than everything. Nothing could stop me. And true to all art, I really hope this is the last one because this is so stupid. I hate this part of the game, man. The Golden Rod's not any better either. That whole like radio top. Oh, I'm gonna eat that up. Okay, we really didn't eat that up. It's Jesus Christ, that did so much damage. I was not prepared at all for that. I'm also not prepared for us like not doing any damage to these dudes. We do none. But yeah, I also want to put the choice specs on Nano. Because I don't think if we're just if we have choice specs uh, flamethrower, what's the point of even using Thunder Punch? Like this is it's just gonna be so much more. It's stab boosted. It's already one-shotting things while life orbed. I'm just gonna put the choice specs on him right after. Well, if I remember after this, I should remember. All right, but I'm definitely switching out. Can't run from a trainer battle. Dang it. That's what I've always wanted to do. I've always wanted to run away. My heart, it couldn't take it. If Kelfir just died there, oh my god. See, I didn't know they had crunch. I just thought it was only assurance. So if I knew he had crunch, I wouldn't have even taken the risk. But yeah, see, why is he going for that? If I don't get it. I'll never understand the NPC mindset. But that thing is dead. Raticate is crazy in this game, bro. I don't know what they started feeding the Raticate in this region. It's all Youngster Joey. That's why he gets a new Rattata every time, because he just releases the Rattata. He trains into the wild. I want to do a Youngster Joey run for fun. Like, if you guys know, like, you just use a Rattata the whole game. And there's a way to do it. You can beat the whole entire game with just a Rattata. And for some reason, I really want to do that. Not, not on the channel. Maybe as like a Twitch live stream. Because I want to get back into streaming. I say get back because I used to stream a lot more than I, you know, do now. And it's not hard for me to stream a lot more than I do now because I don't really stream. Coughing. It's just the same drill. Just go for explosion. And almost kill me. I, I hate how they're the exact same trainers, man. I don't know why they do that. I forgot to put the choice specs on, by the way. I don't know how I forgot. I just went for quick attack. I want that to sink in for a second. I, I actually just clicked quick attack with a Typhlosion. See, if we were choice specs, we would have been locked in there. So I guess it's good. So I guess once I uh, get the choice specs on Typhlosion, I'll, uh, I'll switch Flamethrower to the number one spot. So I don't have to worry about that. But Nano, I'm, I love Nano. Nano is taking lives of everything. Here's another Raticate. Dude, I hate dealing with these things, bro. They're so annoying. I mean, it's really nice that I know Brick Break now one-shots. Um, Crunch does a hell of a lot to me, though. And with the defense drop, it's really scary. And let's say that does, like, almost enough. I have to switch out because the defense drop, and then I'm not faster, and Shadow Sneak doesn't affect him, and it's honestly just a nightmare. It really just is. All right. But I think we're almost done. I think this is the last um, one of these battles. So we should be good. We should be good. There's just a lot of training at this point. And at least they're like better Pokemon and it's not like stupid fights. I mean, it is kind of stupid because it's the same freaking fight every single time, but you know what I mean. And we don't have any healing potions, which kind of scares me. Uh, so I guess I'll just keep one, just in case. Oh no, Lance heals our Pokemon right here. There we go. So I've just wasted a bunch of hyper potions, which is kind of depressing, but you know what? It's okay. It is okay. So this is the part where we need to... Um, what's it called? We need to get the passwords, right? I've never seen a Weeping Bell do so much damage in my life. Insane. Dust Ox. Or nano. Choice specs. I gotta say to myself, choice specs, choice specs, choice specs, choice specs, choice specs, just so I remember it, because I keep forgetting. I don't know how I forget. I'm just letting my mind wander. Alright, you are dead. Get blown back. Alright, choice specs. I'm not forgetting this time. Absolutely zero chance I'm forgetting. No way. Choice specs. Boom. Look at that. There we go, and also, like I said, 
There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. All right, I honestly might just lead with like, should I lead with Zombie? Probably. That way I don't have to switch out to another Pokemon and uh, have them take damage on once they come in. Oh, perfect matchup too. Perfect. I feel like Kingler is, no, Kingler, I was just about to say, I feel like Kingler is rock type in this game, but he's not considering that would have just destroyed him if he was, but fortunately no. It's okay though. Shellgon. We have Ice Fang. Yeah, I, I always forget about Intimidate. I need to remember that, because that's gonna, that can be really helpful. Like, if I need to pivot into something, I get the Intimidate off. I don't know, I, I'll probably remember it when it really matters, when it's crunch time, because then I tend to, like, think things through a little more. Now I'm just really just trying to get through the hideout. Uh, uh, in order to unlock the door to the radio transmitter, you need the voice of a certain person. The name of the person is Petrol, the team rocket executive. It's hiding in the leader's office. Leader's office first, okay. Wasn't the password like, Raticate Tail or Slowpoke Tail Snatch? Interesting. I think this dude has it. Yeah, he literally just told us. And then one dude's in that one little room. And of course they have a freaking Raticate. I'm going for this, I wanna see how much this does. Defense fell. Now nah, we got it. We should be fine here. Assurance, yeah. We good, he was stupid. I'll just go for Psycho Cut, because I know Razor Leaf can miss. So I'll just go for Psycho Cut. Kill that thing, but I'm definitely switching out now. It's up a barrel too, that's that's free food. That's seafood, I mean, not really seafood, because you don't really see too many big barrels living in, the, living in the sea. It's mostly like a lake, probably, right? I mean, I'm, not, I'm no big barrel aficionado or anything. And even at minus one, we were able to just destroy that. Wait, what's the password? Dubious disc. Okay, so if we ever get a Porygon, like we are we are ready. And I think it's this girl right here. I think it's this girl. I don't know. I've just done this so much that so I remember. I would love to hit this thing up, but I just I don't I don't trust it. Just destroy it with an aerial ace, but it's not, it would definitely not die. And oh went for Mega Drain too. I thought it was just gonna go for Sludge Bomb. That'd have done absolutely nothing. It might as well have healed me. It really might as well have. That's why I I kind of wish Leafy M was a little more on the special side so that we could take advantage of like uh, moves such as uh, Giga Drain so we get health back and stuff like that. I don't know. I feel like this would be a lot easier. Uh, but yeah, we are definitely on par with levels now. Uh, just, you know, minus our two level 44s, but even then, like, th that's level 41, so the boss is going to be pretty high. Oh, there's Stab. 80. We already have Stab, but I mean, like, better Stab. Alright, so there we go. Slowpoke tail. So we have them both now. That was easy. They literally just tell you. Like, if my... <laughs> if I was an evil boss and my clients... Not clients, I guess my... Employees gave out the password to my secret room after losing a battle, I would be so mad. What else do we... What other... Oh no. It's over. It's over. Oh my god, this is the one Pokemon you never want to crit, and it's for that reason. If he went for counter, we would have had a dead Leafeon, and he didn't. What a freaking dummy. Oh my god. They probably put him there to end Nuzlocks. Ah, oh, that's such a Nuzlocke killer. Wobbuffet. Ooh, Dark Pulse. That's really nice, actually. I don't know who can learn that. I'm pretty sure Luxray can, but that doesn't really matter, but... Kelfier can. You can normally learn, uh, you normally get Dark Pulse in the Victory Road, I'm pretty sure, so I wonder what TM they placed it with. Oh no, we're not ready for this. I know you don't, I'm pretty sure you don't battle in here, right? We're not prepared. This is such a bad idea. I need to go back and heal and buy items. Oh, he just leaves. Oh, thank you. I was gonna say, I think we're prepared for this fight. But definitely not for, um... For what's it called? Yeah, I, gotta, I can't bring my heart to be ballsy enough to do that. Let's go get items real fast. It won't take too long. 
They give an easy warp out of here. Um, I guess we don't even need the warp. All right. No, there it is. I just didn't know where it was. Is there a warp back there? There isn't. That's so dumb. All right, Lyra, I totally get you want to call me, but I don't give a flying fadoodle. I really don't. You can't even buy things here. That sucks. And I really don't want to go... And whatever. Okay, I I'm good now. It was just a matter of being healed. I feel comfortable now. It was just like, I didn't want to have Zelda be half health. Now I'm comfortable with the fight, because we at least have one Hyper Potion to work with. And... I don't know. And we'll get there at full health as long as I dodge all the trainers. And I should, because it's not really hard to dodge all the trainers. Alright, here we go. Door opens. Alright, so he's, he's gonna have Nido Queens and stuff. I'm just... Oh, Nido King, Nido Queen. I don't even know if we battle him here, because it's not Giovanni, it's Petrol. I've been waiting for you. So you're Supra. Me? You don't know who I am? Yeah, it's Giovanni. The, uh, the majestic Giovanni himself. Wow. Huh? I don't sound anything like Giovanni. I don't even look like Giovanni. How come? I've worked so hard to mimic him. So you're back again. You must be trying to sneak into a radio transmitter room. Well, that's not going to happen. The room is protected with a special password. The password is Hail Giovanni. Uh, the door open. Unless I say the password, it only reacts to my voice. Well, thank you for telling me that very specific bit of information that I'll probably need a little bit later after this battle. Alright, so he's got a scun tank. And I definitely want to switch out. And if I get pursuit trapped, I'm actually going to cry myself to sleep. Thank you. Oh my god. I'm not kidding. That would have been... You guys would have been seeing me cry right there. You are dead. I don't care. That is a choice specs and you are not dead. Interesting. I was so confident too. I really was. Every second I thought we had levitate, but it doesn't matter, obviously, because it doesn't do anything, but... Alright, there we go. Wheezing. I'm just gonna stay in. I... D I don't know. I'm... Holy crap, that did a lot. Alright, well, I'm gonna switch out now. Oh, wait, hold on. Explosion, don't go for it. Thank you. Wait, that's bad, too. Hold on. Hold on. I'm killing you right now. Get out of here. Get out of my sight. No way. I don't know what I was thinking. I was thinking that was a physical move. I don't know why. I really don't know why. I just couldn't tell you. I don't know why I thought that was a physical move. See, we would have been totally boned if we did this. Without, um, what's it called? And is it, doesn't dark normally resist poison? Or am I thinking about something else? I don't know. I don't know why that did so much. Uh, what are we doing against this thing? I guess nano. I guess I just flamethrower. I mean, it has. It should have dry skin, right? Yeah, because it didn't. Ha it it would have had anticipation, and it would have said its anticipation made it shut. Actually, would it have said its anticipation make it stutter because we don't have anything super effective? So, it doesn't have dry. We're dead. We just lost my favorite team member. <gasps> Let's go. If he had Sucker Punch, that would have been another thing that I would have just cried with. Oh my god. Thank you. Oh no, now it's Eradicate. Alright, I'm going hard Shaggy. I'm going hard Shaggy to deal with this thing. I feel like Double Edge, if you miss Double Edge, you should, you should do damage to yourself, just like how High Jump Kick does it. Or Takedown, really. Oh, I guess we're just never hitting moves. Oh, we just don't hit moves out here. We really don't. Alright, but we're gonna hit this. Boom! There we go. We just beat Petrol. Get out of my sight! Get out of my sight. I couldn't do a thing. Giovanni, please forgive me. Well, I'll forgive you, because I am Giovanni. Since disbanding Team Rocket three years ago, our Giovanni has something something. But we're certain he's waiting for the right time for our revival. Uh, losing to you won't change the fact that you are unable to get this radio uh, get into the radio transmitter room. You need my voice to unlock it. And he just ran into a door. And he's gone. Alright, well, oh yeah, chat top, my best friend, Hail Giovanni. 
Uh, Chat out is mimicking the voice of petrol. You may be able to dot 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 exclamation point question mark. All right, well, I think that's actually a great place to wrap up today's episode right there. Uh, I know we're kind of low on health, but I guess at the start of the next episode, we'll just make our way over to the Pokemon Center, and I'll be fine and dandy. Hopefully, you guys did happen to enjoy this episode. I know there's a lot of weird part. There's like a little filler in the middle, but you know what? It's okay. At the end of the day, we're just playing Pokemon and having fun, but hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode. Make sure you drop a like if you did, and I'll catch you guys next time when we finish out this hideout, and I guess take on Price. That should be pretty interesting. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.